Before we start the video, I just gotta give a huge thank you to Activision for sending me an early review copy of Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2. In this video, I'm playing on Xbox One. We're just gonna go over some of the levels, take a look at those. I'm gonna give you my first impressions of the full game's gameplay. I already did a video on the warehouse demo, but yeah, let's just jump into it. What is up guys, welcome to a brand new video here on the channel. As you can see right now, I'm Rodney Marlin. Let's just go over some of the characters we have here. Of course, we have Tony Hawk, Bob Burnquist, Jamie Thomas. I also really want to play as Jamie Thomas, actually. We'll do that after Rodney. But we also got the inventor of the cab, Steve Caballero, Bucky Lasek, Rune Cliffberg, shout out to my home country of Denmark, Kareem Campbell, Jeff Rowley, Eric Carsten, Elisa Steamer, Chad Muska, looking pretty retro. Andrew Reynolds, and then we have the new cast, so we got, I'm not wearing my glasses, but Nishimura, I don't know how to pronounce that, I'm sorry. Leo Baker, Letitia Buffoni, Alicia Monto, Nigel Houston, Tony's son, Riley Hawk, Shane O'Neill, and Skate of the Year, Tyshawn Jones. But then if we go into Skate Tours, we can choose between Pro Skater 1, Pro Skater 2, or just Ranked and Free Skate. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna start with the Ranked and Free Skate. Just choose a level I think would look cool. So School, that would be very cool to check out. Maybe Streets as well. You know what? Let's go to Streets. We'll just Free Skate for a little bit, and then afterwards we can go into some actual challenges in one of the games. And the thing I love about this remake is that it is a remake, it's not a remaster. So it's the old levels that's looking really, really good. But then we have more controls than we did back then. So we got the Pro Skater 4 controls with the manual stuff. We got reverts. We got the double tap flip trick. So we got some good looking tray flips. I'm actually really surprised at how good they look. And yeah, I changed the camera. So let's just go to the default camera. I got it on low, but we'll go to this one. That is what it's gonna look like the first time you're gonna launch the game. We got a little tray flip, 360 shove it, laser, 360 inward heel, and 360 hard flip. But yeah, this right here is Embarcadero, a pretty famous spot in real life. But as you can see, it's grass up here. It's, it's, not, it's not really the classic way, so they definitely renewed the spots. If we can ollie up here, then we got the gone scab down here. We can try to kick flip that, but it is gonna be a little bit weird. I guess that's one of the modern changes to the game, or the levels rather, but yeah, okay. All right, we got all the uh, on-screen options on again so that you guys can see what tricks we're doing and how many points I'm losing when I fall like that. But it's pretty cool that we got some famous spots here in the game. So we got EMB as we just checked out, and as you can see here, we have Hobber Hideout. What if we did a Veril heal here? A little nose grind there, boom. Trying to go realistic in a Tony Hawk game. What? I've always loved the manual trick combos though, so I think it's really awesome that they're in the game. That's why I got a bit like disappointed with Pro Skater 5, because it didn't seem like a continuation of Pro Skater 4. Like we got less tricks, worse levels, and just nothing really good in that game to be honest. The trick animations are looking better in Pro Skater 1 and 2. The levels are looking more detailed than ever in any of the games. And it just feels good. It, it feels like, I don't know, Pro Skater 4-ish? Pro Skater 4 with a little bit of, of underground. Oh, we got the one wheel nose manny one foot. Jesus Christ. We of course also have the grind switch ups, which we didn't have in Pro Skater 1 or 2. I, I don't believe so. So yeah, it, it just, it feels so good, this game. Before we change the level, I just gotta check this out. So, it, what? That was some police talk, but I just wanted to go up here. Got a little kickflip on the fountain gap. That sounds a bit like, uh, like Philly. We've got a no comply on to the next level. Let's go up here. Be careful not to fall off the roof. Yeah, what did I just say? We are just gonna try that again. Let's get a tray flip across the gap this time. Okay, I almost fell off, so I just got into a grind just to make sure. <laughs> All right, here we go. I think we're going off this. Oh no, kind of messed up there. <laughs> One foot tail grab through that gap. All right, all right, let, let's change the level. 
I'm also gonna change the character to Jamie Thomas. Both him and Rodney are one of my favorite pro skaters of all time. I did play the warehouse demo, so I think you should go to Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2 and just try to go for the first goals here at the hangar. So we got all the classic goals, of course, and it's been years since I've played the original Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2, so I don't know if they've changed the locations of the letters or pilot wings or stuff like that, but we'll, we'll just like try it out and see how the game feels and it is looking so good, even on my standard Xbox One. Oh my God, that is just looking so different. The letters, nothing like they looked like in the past. Oh, let's just get a little uh, nose grind here. Oh, that didn't count. Am I supposed to not like Ollie out? Oh wow, already like blowing it completely. All right, we did set the chopper off or helicopter, whatever you want to call it. What, can I not, can I not get that? Come on, give me the tea. This is a disastrous first run. Finally got it. Also got a little uh, pilot wing here, which I couldn't get. Wow. I flew over it, nice. I didn't see where the other one was, over there. All right, let, let's just get the secret tape while we're at it. Maybe just get the E here. All right, we got skate. Let's get the secret tape. Try to get some points. Oh, there were some barrels right there. Got another achievement, I think. It's not popping off on my Xbox because I got my PC open. Was I actually in a, in a manual there before? Looked a little bit weird. But all right, let's not pop out of it this time. There we go. My score level is so freaking low. That's also because I'm messing up on easy tricks. No, 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 let's just get the barrels. All right, four out of five barrels. Where are the last barrels? All right here. Okay, we got some of the more the more easy, uh, easy accomplishments or goals, levels, tasks. Let's just land this one and start a new combo. Over time. Did I land it? No, I didn't. Yeah, we didn't get the uh, six score. Three hang time gaps. What gaps are those? We unlocked a new park though. School two, let's just check that out. I haven't even seen this level yet. I actually hadn't really seen the hangar either, but I just wanna skate around here, not really worry too much about the goals. All right, we're up in the scores a little bit, of course. High combo as well, collect skate, five hall passes, grind three call rails, roll call rails, TC's roof gap, kickflip, get the secret tape. All right, five bills. All right, I really want to check out the famous, oh, of course we got the leap of faith here, as Jamie Thomas. You guys know to do a little melon down leap of faith. What? Oh my God, you're riding crazy, man. What's up with all these crazy drifters? A little hard flip. I do love the look of the tricks now. When we saw the first trailers of the game, I could see that it was like uh, reused animations from Pro Skater 5. That, that's what had a lot of people worried. Here we have the famous Gons rail as well. Chad Muska with the 50, Gons with the backside board slide. What should uh, Jamie Thomas do? He'll flip 50, that actually wasn't what I was trying. Pop shove a nose grind. Impossible front crook, okay. Let's just skate around a bit more. Oh, I didn't see it had an edge there, but I should have remembered that from the older games. I think that was Jack Black yelling. <laughs> oh, we got the six score, didn't we? Let's just chill then. <laughs> that definitely is Jack Black. 
Oh, at this level, I really want to check out Carlsbad. But I can't remember how to get there. So I unlocked Marseille, but I think I'm just going to say no thanks and retry this level and then try to get to Carlsbad. I think that's going to be the last thing of this video. Oh my god. There we go. I got seconds to search this thing. I mean, we got a tray flip. I'm not gonna get anything else here, but damn, it looks beautiful. 360 pop shove it, all right. But I actually hadn't like thought of to complete any challenges in this video, but since it is kind of like a first impressions review-ish video, I think you guys should see what the, what the goals and challenges were like, but I'm thinking about starting like a playthrough series of this game here on the channel. I think that could be a lot of fun. Me getting back into like some pro skater gameplay. I'm still like relearning, I feel like, so I'm, I'm still really, really rusty, that's for sure. But yeah, we, we can just have fun with it. Do some really bad compost. Yeah, I need to practice some more, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you got something out of this video. Maybe you want to buy the game for yourself because I can definitely recommend it. Oh, no. Jack Black, where are you? Oh my God. And once again, thank you to Activision for sending me a copy of the game and thank you guys for watching. I'll just be seeing you in the very next video here on the channel. So until then, peace out.